Physician scientists tend to want to do something for their patients, and that's one of the major motivations. And that doesn't exclude doing basic research, but the issue is how will that basic research affect patients? My name is Lauren Michelle. I uh, have a uh, bachelor's in chemistry from Emory University, uh, an MD from Case Western Reserve School of Medicine. Um, I am uh, a trained oncologist um, and did my oncology training in, here in New York at Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center. I think the Damon Runyon Clinical Investigator Award um, allowed me to pursue a relatively high risk, um, high reward project that has significant clinical potential to improve patient care. We're studying a protein called TROP2 that we found um, is overexpressed on the surface of cancer cells, meaning there are, there are a lot of these proteins on the surface of cancer cells. So we're essentially developing a new treatment for cancer. To date, really, there are only three antibodies that are available to treat solid tumors. So uh, just bringing one more to the clinic um, dramatically increases the opportunity for treating solid tumors. When you stop someone from dying from cancer, um, the personal payoff is pretty high. At the same time, when you see someone die from cancer, you want to really do something about it. My long-term goal is to, to enhance the survivability and curability of, of metastatic breast cancer patients.